Welcome to Planet Massage 2 ABB, your designated sector in the binary star system of Akija. I am Ada, also known as Artificial Directory and Assistant, tasked to support pioneers, such as you, in their mission. You are the third of your sector to survive Planetfall. Congratulations. All right. Note. Objective-based introduction initialized. Welcome to onboarding. Okay. First objective. Please dismantle the drop pod. The resulting materials will be repurposed to construct a habitat and utility base from now on referred to as the hub. Note. Sure. Fix it incorporated as cost effective and efficient. We do not waste. That's a cool game mechanic, actually. Uh, you can recycle pretty much everything you build and you get everything back. Alright, so dismantle the drop pod, press F. Alright, to dismantle. And then hold left mouse button. There you go. One hub part. Second objective. Please ensure you have your Fixit Incorporated Xeno Zapper equipped before leaving the drop zone. Right. Note, according to Fixit regulations, every pioneer should have access to a means of defense against extraterrestrial threats. Right. So, press tab to open your inventory, drag and drop equipment to your hand slot to equip. I'm going to press tab. You can actually double click anything that has a spot for it. So I double clicked it. Here we go. Third objective. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. Right. Note. The acquisition of iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Yes. Right. So, to find the iron ore, I think there's some right in front of me. Uh, one reason for this is that there's monsters, and you see these rocks there in my crosshair. Alright, so... I'm gonna do C, iron ore. So scan. Oh, that's actually not iron. Closest iron is over there, 274 meters. Look at this giant moth. We saw it right at the beginning of this video. We can actually ride that thing, but uh, we'll get to that later. So that is not iron. Iron is over there, the closest one. Uh, you see this big arch? That's quite a remarkable feature. I think I'm gonna go more over there because there's a li little area uh, above this level I think that I can use. Right. Uh, if you see these big weird column and the green gas, don't go in there yet. It's uh, not very breathable. Let's pick these up. Ada will This talk consumable to us. possesses minor healing properties. Further analysis required to establish object scanner identification. Pick up some leaves. Initial scans reveal coloring properties in the flower petals. Further analysis required. Alright. I'm gonna go see what mineral is over there. Uh, I'll try not to get killed. Alright, jump! Shoot. Jump! Taze. Jump, taze! Ow! Jump, taze! Taze! Alright. Good. Alright, alright, alright. Grab this. Get a message. Studying the remains of this creature might shed light on how to defend yourself in the future. I recommend analysis. We'll do as soon as we can. Just grab petals, uh, leaves. Because. Right, he sees me. No, four shot? Is it four shots? Come to me. There you go. Alright, gravity is kind of low on this planet. Alright, what's here? Limestone. 
Alright, we need limestone, so I'm gonna grab a lot of it right away. Right, let's me pick that up. This will be boring. I might uh, fast forward this a little bit in uh, post editing. Hundred limestone should do for now. Oh, there's a lizard doggo. All right, I cannot do anything with this little dude right now. So we'll leave him be. Let's pick some marbles. Let's just be careful. To encounter too much hostile life forms. Let's scan for this iron ore again. Right, right here, there's iron. Over there, there's iron. Uh, I kind of prefer the iron over there. But I'll start taking some iron here. Is there are two of those creatures. Just one. Okay, let me just uh, heal up with these nuts. These nuts. All right, uh, there we go. Takes two for a full bar. Uh, let's take this again. So I'm gonna fight this dude. Two hits. Three hits. Four hits. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Is there another one? No. Alright, good. Pick up some iron. I'm gonna get a message. Message, I think. Yeah. Fourth objective, build the hub. Note, to complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod will be consumed. Caution, ensure the hub is built on spacious open terrain close to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do so will likely result in non-optimal progress. Yep. It will not be satisfactory. <laughs> anyway, I'm trying to get... This impure ore takes longer to uh, to harvest, so I'll grab this pure ore. When you find ore, you actually need to break up these little central pillars for putting the uh, automated uh, miners. Okay, I have above 100 ore, iron ore. Let's come over here. This is not too high. I think I hear a creature. Yeah, there's a creature there. Oh shit. Leaves come in useful later. So he actually showed me the softest way down. So he was able to find more limestone. It's impure though. What's over here? Rock quartz. Are ready. Wow, I need this stuff. This mineral shows purity levels akin to synthetic quartz manufactured on Earth. Analysis required to determine precise use. Yes. That's not a lot. You? Nope. 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 Now I hit them. Later it'll be easier to deal with. Alright. I actually need to fight them to analyze their uh, stuff. Alright, more iron. 
he saw me. Is he the only one that saw me? Can I? Yes, two of them. Come at me, bro. It's too bad I can't crouch. Got him. Alright. All right, let's pick up this iron ore. We need a lot of iron in this game. This is normal iron, so that's not too bad. It's better than uh, impure. Let's get these carapace. This iron too. Alright. I thought there was another creature here. There's the one over there. Alright, come at you, bro. One, two. Woo -hoo -hoo. That was close. Three, four. Ow. No, not four. That's four. Alright, what do we have here? Limestone, impure. Take the pure one. That's that. More limestone. Not breaking. Oh, there we go. Uh, so I guess we have two impure nodes here. All right. So I want to build up here. All right. This is a really nice area right here to build. Grab all of this. Try to find a high spot. Right, I want to find a place to put uh, the hub. Down, down over where the iron is, because I'm going to need a lot of iron. Alright. I'm going to put this thing... Like... Let's get some stuff out of the way. Alright. First time I played, I think the, uh, the foliage respawned after a while. I think they, they removed that uh, feature, I guess, I call it. Alright, let's build. I just pressed tab. Uh, no, Q. Sorry. Q. I'm gonna. Whoops. That was a right click. Rotate with the. Uh, Scroll wheel. Alright. 
this down. Look at this. Should get a message. Right. Congratulations. You have unlocked hub feature manual craft bench. Hub feature hub terminal. Fifth objective hub upgrade storage and power. Note, the craft bench and hub terminal are essential for progression to the next objective. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so, upgrade the hub by using the hub terminal. Press E. Select tier 0. Hub upgrade 1. So when once we do this, I'm going to select it. Whoops. Once we do this, we are going to get all those things. Craft bench, equipment workshop, smelter, we can build power lines, a portable miner, uh, we can scan for copper ore, after that we can make cable, wires from copper ingots, sorry. We can build xeno zappers, we just had the one we had with, ours, with us in the pod, so now we can make more. Uh, just come back to the copper, you make copper first ingots, which makes wire, and with wire you make cable. Anyway, so I need 10 um, iron rod. Right, let's go to the craft bench. Uh, this is a new thing with the last update. You can select to only show affordable recipes. So recipes you have materials for. Let's do some ingots. I think I will forward this. And we're done. One thing with crafting is that you can simply hold the spacebar and it will craft stuff for you. So I've got myself a little metal weight that I place on my space bar when I have a lot of stuff to craft. Eventually stuff will be made automatically like we're making a factory after all. But uh, for now I use the little uh, metal weight. We'll, we'll just uh, craft 10 of those. Right. And we go back to the terminal. Double click on these, they should pop right in their spot, and we can upgrade the hub. Alright. Ada should talk to us. Congratulations, you have unlocked hub feature biomass generator, hub feature personal storage, scanner feature copper. New equipment, buildings, and blueprints, which can be found in the workshop when built, build menu, and craft bench, respectively. Sixth objective, hub upgrade, construction. Note, connect buildings to a generator for power. Note, buildings such as the smelter require a blueprint to be set. Advice, automate the smelting process and use portable miners for optimal results. All right, so complete hub of a grade two. Hold C to select the resource to scan for. Build equipment workshop and craft a portable miner. Equip a portable miner and place it on a resource node. Build a smelter to automate production of ingots. Use the biomass burner to supply power to your buildings. All right, let's check this out just to remove the exclamation point. This burner here. I'm gonna check it out. Here you can place the raw material, biomass of any kind, leaves, wood. Anyway, we'll touch on this later. Uh, let's go to the hub terminal. Select upgrade two. What do I need? Well, I'm gonna select this manual. All right, let, let's look. Two more inventory slots, which is nice. Can carry more stuff. The constructor, the power pole, that's gonna be necessary. Biomass, we can craft biomass. We can make concrete. 
This is why I got all the limestone. We can make screws, reinforced iron plates, and we can scan for limestone, but I have some right here. So let's select this. I can do the, both of those first items. So let's do 10 iron plate, 3, 4, 10, and 10 iron rod. go place this in this as well I need to find the copper I should probably heal up a little bit all right um, yeah nothing here for now put this back. Yeah, I can't craft. Let's scan for copper again. The nearest one is over there. Right on top there. Alright. Okay, there's probably a creature up there. Uh, we have a flashlight. You press V for it. Grab more of this. Right. Here's something. Oh, he's right there. Damn. There we go. All right. I think Copper's right on top of this. Yeah. All right. Let's get some copper. Now grab some more. Alright, since uh, one inventory slot fits 100, that's why that, that's what I'm grabbing. Okay, grab some more leaves. Alright. Heading back to the hub. Now you see that thing, shiny thing up there? We're gonna grab that later. But for now just want to upgrade the hub. Alright, I've got copper. Let's make some copper ingots. Alright, now without removing my weight from the spacebar, I'm gonna click on wire. I'm just gonna keep making stuff. Alright. So, wire, you can actually hold 500 in an inventory slot. But I'm going to put, put this here. I'm going to double click, and it's only going to take 50. Let's upgrade. Bam. Congratulations. You have unlocked Scanner Stone. New buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Seventh objective, hub upgrade, conveyor belts. Note, use power poles to expand the power network for optimal results. Note, constructors are capable of constructing copious parts, of which only one type at a time. Okay. So, let's see here. If I get hub upgrade tree, three, excuse me, I'll get one more inventory slot, conveyor poles, conveyor belts, foundations, ramps, walls, and biomass. We'll select this, but 
think we can start uh, automating stuff. Alright, let's look what we can build here. The craft bench. So we're not limited to this craft bench. We can build some anywhere we, we can. <laughs> I was about to say we want, but you can't build everything everywhere you want. Anyway, the equipment workshop. I think I'm, I'm, I'm gonna build one of that. You can add it to the to-do list. You can make more than one or less. You can add or remove items to your to-do list. So to make one of those I need six plates and six rods. Uh, we can make smelter, smelters now. And we can make constructors as well. Um, I was planning on building a building to put a few things in here to make a iron factory. So I might move the hub soon. Where should, uh, I wanted to make an equipment workshop, so let's make some plates. Four, five, six rods. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. Um, I usually like to put that thing real close, like as close as possible, so I can switch between equipment and craft and terminal. But not that. Right, let's get in here. I want a portable miner. I'm gonna right click on it and add it to the to do list. So I'm missing a few things. Some plates, one, two, three, four, some cable, one, two, three, four. Alright. You see all the numbers update as I craft stuff. Uh, so let's make one of those. It takes longer to craft than the other things. Alright, so to place that down, come here, put it in my hands. Alright, this is what the top looks like. Fine. And then I'm gonna click. Left click. And this little guy is gonna mine for me. I'm going to make a second one for limestone. So I needed four of those. One, two, three, four. And four of those. One, two, three, four. I should be able to make another one. Yes. Alright, so those things will harvest a hundred for each material for me. Alright, let's put it here. Now that we've thoroughly looked at it once before, it doesn't look at it the same way the second time. Click and place. Alright. So, I think I have everything I need for the next upgrade. Let me just put this back in my hands. Alright, so, we need. 75 plates. Alright. 75 plates. We need a temp cable. Ten. Alright. Uh, I'll need to make some reinforced iron plates and I think I need iron rod for that. Let's see. No, I actually need screws, but I did need uh, to make rods in order to make screws. How many? Two? Yes. I just got I, I got just enough to make two of those reinforced plates. Plates. And I need to make concrete. Alright. 
We need to make 10 of these. Alright. I'm actually gonna craft it all the way. Because uh, limestone is not useful in itself. I have two left. That's what's annoying with some recipes. Is that you need three of these and you pick up a hundred so you have some leftovers. You can just put it in the trash right here to free up your inventory. Okay, let's go back here. Click on this. We'll click on this. Ah, oh, shoot, forgot. We'll click on this. We'll click on this. I need to make some more plates. Um, ten and one, two, three, four, five. That should do it. Yes. All right. Let's upgrade this hub. Good, good, good. We're getting in the sedge. Congratulations. You have unlocked new buildings and blueprints, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Okay. Eighth objective. Hub upgrade, additional power. Advice. When planning the construction of buildings, note the placement of conveyor belts. Caution. Overloading the power network guarantees suboptimal performance. Yes, it will not be satisfactory. Alright, let's select this next upgrade. I can already place the limestone here, uh, the concrete here for it. I'll need to grab some more of this. Ta da! 100. Uh, I should build another miner for the copper. And I can actually build a conveyor belt, so I think I'm gonna build some. So I need iron plates for that. Alright, let's do some ingots. Alright. Let's make some plates. Right. Uh, and I want to make a uh, portable miner. Oh, I can't. Can I make a full miner right now? I cannot. That's annoying. I have 50 plates, right? I need 50 more. Which means I need a hundred of this. Alright. Some more ingot crafting. Alright. Let's put the place here. And we'll need more iron. In the meantime, I'll craft those 20 wires. Uh, cables, sorry. Alright. Just to give it some chance. Uh, what do I need to make that? I need four more wires. Four. And I need four plates. I only have one. Do it back here. Grab this. We'll make some ingots. Plates. Here, let's make this. Alright. Huh, 
We'll place it next to the other one. No, not this. This. It's here. Place it. Put this back in my hand. Grab more of this. Grab more of that. Come back here. As you can see, we need a lot of iron. Okay, I can see that I can make the 75 I need for the hub upgrade, so I'm gonna do that right now. Alright, let's take a look at this. This upgrade. Alright, let's hear what Ada has to say. You'll build the Congratulations, you have unlocked hub feature, additional biomass generator, new buildings which can be found in the build menu. Ninth objective, hub upgrade, molecular analysis. Note, to ensure full mastery of skills and equipment, I have been asked to not interfere with this last objective. Good luck. Alright. This is good. I'm gonna pick up this miner. This one as well, because uh, let's see, I can make miners now. I need more rods, uh, more ingots. Uh, how much rod did I need? Let's try just making this much. All right, can I make a miner? Yes. Alright, I'm going to place this miner right here. Okay. Facing a little bit like this. I need to bring power to this thing. Uh, let's see if I can do anything. Yes can make biomass. This is good. Let's make biomass. Every time you process the bio stuff, uh, it, it increases the energy level it has. So here I'm going to put the biomass in here. It's 200. And I'm going to hit two and I'm missing cable. Some cable. I can make some cable. Alright. Hit 20. Hit 2. The power line. Then I'm gonna bring. No, actually, I should leave this here. Alright. Make one here. Alright. And I'm gonna make one for this one as well. That will come in handy later. Right. Bring this here. Now the power poles are always a bit tricky to deal with in the beginning. Right. This makes an, a very scary noise. Uh, I'm good with this for now. This is going to mine for me, and I'm going to make uh, some more ingots. Okay, let's make some plates. And some wire. Uh, rods, I mean. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Last hub upgrade. I have far from the amount I need. Alright. I need to make another miner for copper. I can't make. 
Alright, let's go make it. Uh, I need to bring power over there. So, let's see if I can. I'm gonna put this uh, like over here. In case I need to put the miner there. Hopefully I have enough wire. Come over here. Build that down here. Oh, there's a creature back there. Let's go back up here. Right. Grab that. Bring it over here. Bring it up here. Okay. Now I'm going to build a miner for copper. Alright. We'll go over there. There's another creature back right there. I wonder what, what's over there. Anyway, let's power this puppy up. is how to build items. So number one is power pole, number two is wire, number three is conveyor, and number four is conveyor pole. Right, so this kind of glitches here. Uh, let's see, which way is that? I want to just put this, put it here. So I'm gonna hit four to get the pole. And if I click once and look up there, it's gonna extend it. And then I can try. You hear that sound? It means it's quick. Looked in. Too steep. Oh, not too steep. But I don't want this to be too low to the ground. So we're gonna do that. Alright. Beep here. And now I'll see how far I can go. Is this far, and then we could put another pole. Too high. Click this there and here, and now I only have six left. Six plate left, so I need to go grab some more iron ore. Grab this. Here, make some ingots. All right, make more plates. Okay, should be able to build more conveyor belt. This I can rebuild later if I don't like how it is right now. Here. Four. There. Actually, looking at the creatures walking in the distance. Uh, 
And like, they behave like ants would. Anyway, put this here. I think I can build a constructor. Yes. I am missing reinforced plates. Alright, let's add this to the build list. Alright, let's come here. Uh, we need to make screws, I think, in order to make three. Oh, I'm, I'm missing stuff. Alright, let's go back here. So that's the initial circus of this game. Once you got the basics started, it starts to pick up speed. Alright, let's make some rods. More screws. Oh, I need more plates. Uh, what am I missing to make three of those? I make two. Missing screws. So more screws. Make another plate. Alright, now I can build the constructor. Alright. Build that right here. I'll mo definitely move this later. For now, so power it. Make it make some uh, wire. And do it three here. That. This stuff will come here. It will make wire for me. How amazing. Alright. Um, yeah, this really will be in the way for my iron building. Iron making building. Uh, can I make foundations yet? Let's see. Foundations? Yes, I can. 8x2, 8x4. Four meter ramp and two meter ramp. I just need to make concrete and I'll go over there for that. Alright. So let's pick up some limestone. There was missing a one to make the last concrete bit. So here, make some concrete. Thirty-three concrete. We'll see if it ends up with no what. Anyway, let's put 30 concrete in here, like this. Uh, it needs a lot more plates than what I have. Alright, uh, that is full, so let's go grab this. I need to build a smelter. Quick. Can I build a smelter? Yes, I have what it takes. Right, let's do this. That will stay save a step for now. Just go grab this, put this here, make some iron and get. Uh, shoot! I'm missing something. Like a smelter. I'll put a smelter, smelter like over here. Can I make a second one? Yes. All right. But build this here. Like this. Give it some power. Hopefully, it won't be too much power. 
copper ingots. Should make that. Spin that. Uh, back here. Actually, no. Let's make the. Ah, uh, no, no, no. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put that here. Pick that over. Well, not, not quite here. I think I'm gonna put the thing more to the side here. Like this. Take this out. All right. Make the constructor here. Ah, uh, no, that was bad. Yeah, just climb on this belt. Just to give me a better perspective. Uh, that's better. Make this. What? Come on. Just to this. Alright. Give me power. I don't have enough cable. That's annoying. That's really annoying. Uh, can I make some? Yes. Alright, that should be enough. There you go. Alright, you make wire from copper ingot. Alright, this will eventually make a hundred. Uh, no, five hundred actually. Alright, has this made... Uh, what is it missing? Oh, it's missing the ore. This. Good, good, good. Alright, so this should save me a step. Alright. And I took too much power. Alright, let's add some of this stuff here. I make this to this and get the car back on. Alright, so Ada told us about that. Alright, let's have a look here. I already have 30 of those. If I want, I can grab some off here. Oh, wait, what's going on here? Well, that was the power power loss. Right, let's grab this stuff because I will need to make more power. Alright, whoa. Let's this consumable out. possesses minor healing properties. Further analysis required to establish object scanner identification. Yeah. There's a creature down there. I don't know what it's guarding. But this thing... I, I won't scan it. But you see, it does one full health. Right, let's go see what this dude is guarding. Alright. Too. Want some of this? Ah! Damn. Ah. Ah. That kind of sucked. Oh well. Let's grab these. Alright. No, not this. This. Are they guarding these? Oh my god. Oh, what's over here? Stuff here. Let's grab these. What's this? Limestone. Ah, that's disappointing. 
That's really disappointing. Okay. Some nuts and limestone. Oh, there's a cave here. We'll explore that later. Let's grab more biomass stuff. It's well needed. You need it all. Might as well, since we're waiting for those to make their stuff. Alright, let's craft. Do some crafting. With biomass. Alright, wood biomass. There we go. Let's fill up the generators. Generate for us all of this needed to fill. Like this. Not as much, but still. We could take it. Right, this one is stalled. Okay. This one is not anywhere near what we need it to be. Alright. Let's uh, put this in. Put this in. Put this in. Do I have the scanner yet? No, it's the next tier. Alright. Uh, I can still craft some of this. But we'll be doing Dune. <laughs> we'll be done with crafting iron ingots real soon. Okay, let's put the stuff in here. That's good. Need to make a lot more of these. Check this. Make some of these. Oh, by the way, the crafting bench remembers the last recipe you did. How lucky is that? That we fall on this number. <laughs> there we go. Only missing is uh, the wire. Okay. 69 as well. I'm gonna grab some copper ingots just in case. Yeah, I'm gonna need them. Uh, here. 446. I need less than 50, uh, more than 50. 54. Uh, here. Oh, that climbs fast. Alright, 54. Right on the money. There we go. Tier, no, hub upgrade 5. You have unlocked Pup Feature Molecular Analysis Machine, also known as the MAM. Building Biomass Burner. Building Space Elevator. Equipment Object Scanner. Equipment Beacon. Additional Hand Equipment Slot. Motivational Message. Congratulations, you succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. 
Additional knowledge. The hub terminal has been converted to give access to milestones there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocols. Additionally, the man provides the opportunity to send samples of xenobiology and other materials I deem relevant to R&D in exchange for appropriate rewards. Ooh. Note, future developments should be aimed at constructing the space elevator and thus initiating project assembly. Good luck. Alright. Let's check out the man. So, I can analyze stuff. I'm going to start with analyzing the alien carapace. Alright. It's going to take 7 minutes 30 seconds to analyze. Take a look at the hub now. Now that we are out of tier zero, we have tier one and tier two available. Tier one, we can unlock utility things like the lookout tower, biofuel, a lot of wall doors, and the, the one meter high foundation, which is a new thing in the game since the big update. Logistics will give you productivity display when you're uh, when you open the machine dialog screens. You'll see the productivity. You'll have conveyor splitters, mergers, and lifts. These are really practical. Those two are actually quite practical. All right, personal storage. Quite simple, just a storage box, ah, storage box, and inventory slots. Now this is great. Conveyor walls, more walls that you can have conveyors go through. Stairs, which I don't really like using personally. Then in tier two, we have part assembly, assembler. Some parts you can make with the assembler is the rotor and modular frame, which will be used to build more things. I think the assembler requires some frames to make it. Anyway, uh, obstacle clearing. You get a chainsaw and more inventory slots. The jump pads. Uh, these will be practical later when we build tall factories. And the walkways, I don't use them too much, but they can be useful. Alright, so, uh, what is most practical right now? Uh, biofuel. Yes, biofuel. Let's sell this. Okay. So that will be our next goal. And uh, right now, I think we'll be pretty much set for tier one. Uh, what tier are we? Right, tier zero is done for this video. I think I'll do uh, tier one for the next video, tier two for the next on and on, uh, depending on how big the different goals are, uh, we might make more videos with those, but we'll see. So, I guess that will be for, that will be it for now. Thank you a lot for watching, and see you next time.